Your Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, I'm honored to open this year's edition of the Government Services Forum by extending a heartfelt welcome to our distinguished guests of honor, Her Excellency Anna Branabic, Prime Minister of Serbia, and His Excellency Dr. David Singhi, the Chief Minister of Sierra Leone. Their leadership and innovative approaches in their, respect, in their respective nations are source of inspiration, and we are privileged to have them share their insights with us today. Our deepest appreciation goes to both their excellencies for honoring us today. I would like also to wish a warm welcome to all of our esteemed speakers and observers, expressing my sincere gratitude for your commitment to sharing your valuable insights with us at this significant gathering. A special word of thanks is extended to our knowledge partner, EY, who have supported us from uh, the outset and has immense, immensely contributed to our success over the years. Your invaluable contributions have been a cornerstone to our progress. Ladies and gentlemen, as famously stated, the art and science of asking questions is the source of all knowledge. Today, at the Government Services Forum, we continue our quest to pose the right questions and seek the most effective answers. We gather a diverse assembly of government officials, top technology partners, key corporate players, policymakers, and bright academics, all focused on a common vision. Our mission is clear, to build a brighter future for citizens and constituents across the globe. We are dedicated to reimagine the citizens' experience in government services, aiming for seamless, efficient, and effortless interactions. As we embark on this day filled with engaging discussions and innovative ideas, let us remember that our collective efforts and collaborations are key to shaping a future where government services meet the evolving needs of our communities. Together, let's pave the way for transformative change. Thank you all for being part of this journey, and thank you for being here today.